Hello guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you how to add custom thank you page on Shopify. So if you're interested, let's start a tutorial. So for you to add a custom page or thank you page into your Shopify store, what we need to do is we actually need to install a third party application. In this case, go to your settings at the bottom left of your screen here. And from here, choose the option that says apps and sales channel. Now from here, click on Shopify App Store. And from here on the Shopify App Store, you need to search for the following, which is going to be Upsell. In this case, just up in the following Upsell, just press on Enter. And from here, look for Upsell and Cross-Selling, so easy. In this case, go ahead and click on it. And from here, click on Install. And from here, what we need to do next is it's uh, we need to verify that we really want to install this. Just click on the Install button that you see there. And once you've done that, it's going to initiate the process of actually installing it. And from here, you should be able to see the page for uh, basically editing your uh, pages. Now, if this doesn't work, because sometimes it's going to give you this error here, what you need to do is you need to go to your previous page here, go to uh, Shopify.com again into your editor or in admin or your admin page here. Click on the settings at the bottom left of your screen. From here, choose the option that says Apps and Sales Channel and choose Sell Easy here. In this case, go ahead and click on Open App. And from here, it's going to open the app itself in your window here. So let's just wait for it to actually load up. Now, once it actually loads up, you should be able to see the app pricing here. So they currently have the free version, which is 0 to 50 orders a month. But they will give you actually give you a free trial of their of the, uh, their free, uh, premium ver uh, version here, which is around 8.99. So let's go ahead and click on start free trial here. And from here, what we need to do is just confirm it. Click on approve. And from here, we will be able to start using it. Now, in this case, what we need to do first here is scroll down a bit here in the offer section so this is the first thing you see here so you should see the add offer option let's go ahead and click on it now once we've done that what we need to do here is we need to go to the thank you page add-ons here and from here what we need to do is we need to add an offer so go ahead and click on add offer here and from here what we need to do next is we need to edit our page here now in this case, you need to specify the trigger. Like for example, if you want to specify specify various products for this specific offer here, or if you want to use tags or all products. I also have the offer products here, which is manual or automatic. I also have the discounts if you want to, like for example, enable discounts if you want to as well, and other details for your website. In this case, let's go ahead and enter all those details required here. And once you've entered that, you also have to enable the add-on or thank you add-on widget for your or in your settings. So let's go ahead and click on enable now. And once you've done that, it, that should be that should actually enable that widget. Now in this case, go ahead and click on save offer at the top right here. And in this case, so make sure that you fill out all the details here. Now in this case, going to say thank you add-ons offer created. In this case, let's go ahead and click on OK. In this case. Let's go to our settings here, or you could go to your styling here to change a few things on how it actually looks like. Now in this case, just scroll down a bit here. As you can see, you have the take your page widget here. So make sure to enable that. And once you go to your styling here, what we need to do is we need to look for the styling for thank you. Now in this case, uh, you could go ahead and just scroll down a bit here and change a few things if you want to. Now in this case, you can go, go ahead and click on the section here for widgets and change this to thank you page add-ons. And from here on, you should be able to change a few things. Like for example, the button order width, widget paddings, widget margins here, common styling, and a lot more. In this case, you also have the custom CSS here if you want to use it as well. Now in this case, go ahead and apply all the changes that you want here. Click on save at the top right. And from here on, you could test your thank you page by uh, doing a sample order on your page. But that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to NFT Inspo. Thank you for watching.